This is Umar Ahmed for IFL TV, proudly sponsored by Everlast. We're at Wembley Arena, a boxer show tomorrow night. I'm joined by boxer's very own Fraser Clark, the man that everyone's talking about on social media. <laughs> made it, I made it. Yeah, let's, uh, before we come on to the injury, let's actually talk about that. So, of course, you're at the UFC with uh, Anthony Joshua, Derek Chisora, Eddie Hearn, Dana White's in the picture, and uh, Eddie Hearn takes you out the photo uh, because he's too handsome and had to zoom in. So what did you think of that excuse? Well, he, he's that good looking. He, need, he needed to, uh, you know, zoom in to see his face. Um, now listen, everyone's took it a bit more serious than me. You know, to me, it was like, it was nothing. But people like, oh, he's, he's mugged you off. He's mugged you off. I get it. I'm not his fighter. He's not going to, he's not going to pr promote me. Even though he has done, he's promoting me more than he could have if he kept me in the picture. But um, yeah, it's like, oh, it's a bit of banner. Yeah, on a serious note, I'll get why. Oh, here he is. <laughs> Well, I guess you replaced them in the picture. I'm hungover today. Look who replaced them. <laughs> Mr. Ben Shalom. How did you feel about Instagram post? Did you love it? I do, it was very petty from Andy, wasn't it? He's very petty at the moment, but I don't know. Wait, yeah. what a comeback. Yeah, yeah, yeah no. I you know. You can't get one over on Fraser. You won't get one over on me. You're going to have to get up out of bed a little bit earlier, my son. <laughs> yeah, on a serious note, you do make a fair point that, you know, you're not his fighter, so he's got no reason to promote you. But when you saw that initially, what was your reaction that you'd been taking out the phone? I mean, I, I thought, I didn't think, you know, I thought, you cheeky bastard. Because the thing is, when that picture was being taken, I sort of, I sort of already had this scenario in my head. So I was like, I stood to the side and said, no, 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 let them have the picture. All the zone boys and Joshua and Eddie, you know, they're all together. And Joshua said to me, no, no, get in the photo. So he was the one that brought me in. I didn't actually go to stand in it, and it, um, and then he cropped me out. But you know, it is what it is. Like you know, I'm not gonna lose sleep over being cropped out of a photo by Eddie. Do you know what I mean? And then on the reverse, uh, you did that photo where you put Ben's face on Eddie Earn, and uh, it actually gave you more publicity than you could ever dream of. Really, for no doing nothing in training, doing nothing in the ring in a fight, you've gained more publicity than when you first come out of the Olympics. Uh, you know what? And it was just a little bit of banter, just a little like um, a thought that came into my head. Obviously, jumped on Snapchat, did a bit of cropping, put it on there. I thought it was quite funny, posted it, but the reaction I got was better than I thought. You know what I mean, but like I say, just like all this stuff, man. It's like it's all boxing. We're all, we're all boxers, boxing fans, promoters. It was all fun, all, all love. How many Instagram followers you gained? Thanks, Eddie. You got me a thousand followers. I think probably a few more, huh? Um, so what is the update on the uh, hand when are you looking to be back in the ring Fraser? Yeah so um, I'm about uh, one week post op now, um, I've got another six weeks, another five weeks in the cast that's going to come off, we're going to have to rehab for a few weeks and then we'll see where we go from there. How did the pro debut go down? Of course it was a professional debut, it was what it was, it wasn't the toughest opponent you'll ever face so how did that go down with the fans and your, your friends and family etc? Yeah mixed reviews really. Um, Obviously, I did what I had to do, and I, you know, I think I boxed well for saying I was in well within my limits. Um, mixed reviews in the sense that I could have had a better opponent. There was a nightmare with the COVID and a change of opponent. Nothing to do with me, but I'm happy with what I did. Went out there, did my job, and um, you know, people want to criticise me about that. It's out of my hands. I just fight who they put in front of me. Next opponent, hopefully, will be a better opponent, and um, take them one by one. Well, hopefully that heals up quickly and we'll see you back in the ring soon. Just to go back to Photogate quickly as well, is that you who photoshopped it? Because there were some good skills. That's me. That's me. I'm a genius. There's nothing I can't do. <laughs> On that note, Fraser Clark, thank you very much for talking to IFL TV. And as I said, hopefully heal up soon and get back in the ring soon, all right? That's what I want. Respect.